Hey everyone, in this tutorial, we'll be going over how to change the pre-header text in a postcards email template so that you can customize how the email recipient sees the preview in their email. We'll be going over how to change it in the app as well as in the HTML code. And in the app, I have a template like this already created. And to change the pre-header text in the app, it's very simple. All you have to do is go down in the right side menu and in the pre-header text box area, you can change it from the default text to whatever you want it to be. So I will add an emoji by pressing Windows period since I am on the Windows OS and I will just type thanks for subscribing to our newsletter. And I will just press save in the top left corner. And that's everything you need to do to change the preheader text in the app. You can send yourself a preview by pressing the preview button and pressing email preview. And that's everything for the app. Next, we'll be going over how to change it in the HTML code. All right, so next we want to export this template as an HTML file so that we can edit the code. So to do that, press the export button in the top right corner, press download as zip, and make sure you have the host images online option selected so that you don't have to download and deal with the images yourself. I've already exported my HTML file and it's here. I've opened it in a text editor called Notepad++. And the line of code you have to edit is just under the body tag. So to find that line, open the find tool in your text editor. Chances are it'll be control or command F. And this is what you want to search for. Um, it's a body tag, so you can just search body. And But you want to search the HTML element. So open or type the opening bracket type body like that press enter and that is the line of code you want to find and just under that is a span tag and this span tag is what where you want to edit the text so as you can see this is the default pre-header text and i can just change it by pressing delete and typing Thanks for subscribing to our newsletter. And let's add an emoji. And all you have to do now is save it by pressing Control S and you're done. And that was everything for this tutorial. Until next time, see you guys later.